Hey traders, it's August 29th. We're going to look at two symbols today, TNA and ANA. TNA is like a smaller IWM and Alcoa is the trade we put on about a week ago. It's been working, so today we finally took it off. So I'll show you what I saw today that told me to take it off. And in TNA, we put a diagonal in a few days ago, and today we were able to adjust it into a risk-free spread. So now we have no risk to the upside, and we can make $50 if it falls to the downside. I'm gonna break the trade down and show you how it looked in the risk graph when I put the trade on and what it looks like now. So let's get into it. Now we're in the platform. Here's TNA. You can see the pretty large move it had today. Two days ago, it was trading around 32. I sold a diagonal around 31 in the short term options and 29.5 so this is the position that I had on when I put it on I was able to collect two dollars so this is what it would look like in the risk graph. This is your standard risk graph for a diagonal. You make the most money at the short strike. You'll lose about twice as much at the long strike in this example. And if it goes up you get to keep the credit, which was two. So this was the original trade that I put on. Now the adjustment I made was I bought back the short put that was out three days. And at the same time, I rolled, I sold the 29 strike in the same time frame as the other option. So they were both 10 days out now. We, if we analyze this, we can see the two cent credit we collected from opening the trade plus the two cent credit we collected when we adjusted the trade now gives us a four cent credit to put this trade on. Essentially, we were paid $4, and now this is what we're left with. This is our risk graph now. So in the next 10 days, if it stays right here, we'll be able to keep the $4. If it drops down to 29.5, we'll make 20 bucks, and if it drops below 29, we'll make $50. Now we're looking at A&A. &A. We can see there was a really big up move today. It's about a dollar or a little more than a dollar higher than when we put the trade on. IV rank is now at 3.1. So the price has gone up. The rank's gone down. This trade's worked perfect. It's exactly what we wanted to happen. We sold the 22 and a half put out in the October expiration. We sold it for 47. The spread right now is 21 and 24. We bought this back today for $25. We sold it for 47, bought it for 25. That's a $22 profit. The buying power we were using was two hundred and call it fifty dollars so on two hundred and fifty dollars we made twenty two dollars we only paid 
small amount of fees. This was almost a 10% return on capital in, I believe, eight days. Let's look at the IVR chart. On the 21st, the rank was up at 25. That was one of the highest points it's been in, in months. Expecting that to go down, expecting price to stay the same or possibly go up a little bit, it did exactly that. It stayed the same. Volatility just collapsed all the way down to three and the price stayed the same and then went up a little bit. So it's exactly what we needed. All right, so we looked at TNA and we looked at AA. There are two symbols that you could trade for small amounts. The one trade was only using about $250. The other trade was only using about 150 bucks. So anyone can do these trades with a small account. We made $22 using about 250. So we made about 10% return on capital in about eight days. I could go more into about position sizing and trade size. I'm going to do that in another video. So if you want a notification when that video comes out, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe.